In this video, we're going to show you how to ramp a motor above a 60 hertz threshold mark. Uh, on these drives, normally your upper limit is 60 hertz because that's what your motor is rated for in most cases. But sometimes the time comes where you want to ramp it above 60 hertz, which you can do that if you want to, but keep in mind that the torque is going to drop off and you may, your motor may end up pulling more current than what it's rated for. So make sure you are aware of that. Um, but in any case, to allow the parameters to allow you to go above 60 hertz, you have to do a th about three things. So the first thing is we got to set your uh, max frequency parameter FH to 60, above 60 hertz. So go ahead and press mode AUF arrow down to FH, and that's your max frequency. That has to be above 60 first of all. So let's go and make that 70 as an example. And the next parameter. That's good enough. The next parameter is uh, the upper limit, which is the UL parameter. That should be right next to it, capital U, capital L. And just keep in mind that the upper limit cannot be higher than your max frequency, so it's dependent on the max frequency being high enough first. So let's go ahead and program it to uh, 70 as well here. As you can tell, if I keep hitting up arrow key, I'm stuck at 70.0 or 70.4 because that's where the max frequency is programmed as right now. So enter on that, save it. 60 is default, of course. And um, the other thing you have to kind of keep in mind is if you're using analog input, let's say using analog input VIA or VIB, then you also have to make sure that their scaling is adjusted to above 60 hertz as well. So for those parameters, let's say you're using VIA, you have to go to uh, F dash 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 for that. So let's go ahead and arrow up to F as in Frank, dash dash dash. Enter, and the uh, analog input uh, scaling of the change is F204 for this one to make it go above 60 hertz. As you can tell, 60 is 100%. So we gotta make that, um, I guess, as high as we want at this point. And okay, well, this goes higher, but we want it to be uh, 70.4 as an example so far. Okay, that's what our high speed is. All right. Now, if you're using the VIB terminal, that would have been terminal our parameter F213. Just so you know. Okay. So, so we have the max frequency program at 70 hertz or so. We have the upper limit program to 70 hertz or so. And since we're using an analog input. We also have our analog input VIA to be exact. We also have the parameter F204 programmed to um, a value above 60 as well. So, so when you run this drive now, let's go back to our main display here. When you run this drive, this drive should go to right away to 70 hertz because we have a jumper between terminals VIA and PP for max speed. So let's go ahead and give it a run command here. All right, our run command is dropped off. Bear with me here. And there it is. It goes way up to 70, way past 60 hertz mark. And um, this is basically how you program the drive to go above 60 hertz. So you have your upper limit, you have your max frequency, and you also have the analog input scaling above 60 if necessary, um, if you're using analog input. If you're not using analog input, just using a regular preset speed or whatever, or just a uh, low speed setting, just go ahead and make that low speed be higher than 60 as well.